G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another let's play let's go let's see let's do and today what the hell are we going to do? Star Citizen folks and yes check out these guns it would be funnier if they were pointing on the other side of my body but um yeah and uh this guy also or this other player i should say is also looking at it look at his face yeah um i i i, I don't know what to tell you here folks i got out of bed and this is what i got as a result of that so this is going to be a fun one so what are we going to do today well actually we're going to do what i'm calling a luxury um Kovalex delivery run one of those 15k missions which apparently you have to pick up from about several places and drop off in the same or different several places and we are taking the origin 600i why because it's different and also two what the fuck is that ahead hang on is that oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang, on, hang on hang on hang on i'm seeing stuff all over the place here what is going on in area 18 today so that looks like an Aurora Emma that just is coming out of the ground by itself. Okay. There's something else behind that. I couldn't exactly see what that is. And this ship looks like it... Is it upside down? What the fuck is that? Is that an A1 or something? It looks like a Crusader ship. Uh, at least I think. I don't know. Anyway, we're off. We're not going to buggerize around here anymore. We're off to make some money because we need to make some money. In-game currency, AUEC. Take whatever you want. Ev, let's go. All right, so we are now at R Corp Mining Area 48, located on Walla. And um, we're coming in for a landing. I seem to be the only one here, which is also fine. And I've just kind of realized something about this ship, but I'll say it afterwards because I, I, I could be talking shit and I probably am. But anyway, we won't worry about that one too much. Kind of just put the... See, this is the problem, folks. I talk and I talk and I don't even focus on me landing. So I'm just trying to line it up. Obviously, auto landing is not working here. But I do like the fact that this ship gives you a little bit of margin of error. So it is a bit of springs. Oh, the frame rate is so horrible on this place at the moment. But the guns are still out. <laughs> uh, and yeah, are you guys having this problem as well? Please let me know. I mean, if it's just me, I know I asked for it last time. But uh, again, is it just an, a Hey Ev Productions thing? Or is it just like what's happening now? Okay, there's a loot box. Shall we loot it first? Why not? Okay. I don't think I can carry that, can I? I'll go old school. And I will select the location. Uh, move all. Uh, here's a little trick. Sort. And then move it all. Don't ask me why it does that. But there you go. And it doesn't close from there. You're mongrel. Okay. So you have to go to the previous screen to close it. Haha. <laughs> And I saw another one here. Here we go. We're just crawling along. And this one doesn't open. Why doesn't it open now? I think I broke the game. <laughs> okay, let's stop fucking around. Uh, i got to get used to these keys again. Sorry, folks. Um, so we're looking for picking up these two um, packages. And there are two here. So... One thing I know I really did not think about is when I picked the ship, because I thought I'd just be really cool, do it all luxury, but I don't remember this ship having a cargo area. So where the hell am I going to put these, and are they going to fall through the ship? Ah, oh, fuck, I don't know. Uh, we'll find out, folks. We'll find out together. That's all right. First world problems, I know. So here we go. It's funny as hell with those guns sticking out of my back. Wouldn't it be funny if it was knives? All right, so if um, that's not there, here, let's get the elevator down. Come on. I can't start, citizen. Don't do this to me now. There we go. At least this one works. As in the animation. There we go. It's down. All good. Let's jump on. Now... I'm going to select the lower deck because if I was to have like a cargo hold area, that's where I would put it. But then again, I didn't design this ship. 
So let, let's go have a look, folks. So I'm, I apologize for this. I don't know the ship that well. So maybe there is an area for this stuff, but I can't find it. Oh, I don't remember where it was. Okay, so um, that's obviously not it. What is in this? Oh, what happened to the fucking door that was there? All right. So this is a very nice sitting area. I'm afraid to even walk across that. Okay, there's some stairs behind me which leads upstairs. That doesn't help. Um, this elevator, does that go to a cargo area? Uh, okay, this looks like crew quarters. I don't know, would I put it here? Does he, oh. Because there's nothing else past crew quarters except for toilets. As funny as that would be, I would not put leave these packages in the toilets. Just freaking thinking, where would I put it? Does it just make sense to put it kind of here? I'm going to call this the observation room for lack of better words. Maybe? What do you reckon, folks? We just dump it here? Yeah, let, let's dump it here. I don't know if this is going to work or not, but anyway, that's the first one. That's the second one. Okay, we're good to go here. Let's fuck off. Now, I want to put the landing gear up because the arse end of this ship reminds me a little bit different. Yeah, it looks like the Defiant. That's why I had it on my mind. It looks like the Defiant. We're now at Alpcorp Mining Area 45, still on Mala. But yeah, as soon as I had the landing gear up and if I just kind of ignored the engine, from the back, this ship like this looks like the USS Defiant from Star Trek. All right, now I know I'm not going crazy. All right, uh, but what I do realize is, first of all, I see a caterpillar that's already on the um, landing pad over there. And secondly, the good old way of approaching at high speed with the landing gear down and then kind of sliding across the ground. You can't do that anymore because they've now speed limited with the landing gear down, which is, yeah, it makes sense, more realistic because it does cut your speed, but um, yeah, it also cut a bit of the fun out of it as well. So I have to figure out new approach methods now to <laughs> make sure I don't get bored. But there's dust flying up, which is interesting because it all looks like it's, well, white, but the dust is brown. Anyway, we're off. So there's someone with a caterpillar. Who the hell is gonna be there with a caterpillar like doing massive amounts of cargo? With what money? Uh, I've just made like a hundred and something K so far in the first week of playing just by doing missions. I know I'm not playing them every hour, every day, but still that's going to take a fuckload of time for me to get anywhere near that part. But anyway, I'm, I'm digressing. Okay, so here we go. We put this package in there. What's the marker going to give me? Yep, yeah, it gives a little tick and still keeps it on the screen. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go USS Defiant. Off we go. And, oh, fuck, here we go. Humboldt Mines. I don't have to say much about this. And I think I came in a bit too fast. Uh, I should have put the landing gear down. Watch out there, F, 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 F. Oh, fuck. Oh. Okay. The ship kind of still looks okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. We'll put the landing gear down. Yeah, I can't even fucking speak at the moment. We'll put the landing gear down now. Enough of the fastness. The wrong place to put to do the fastness, I should say. Fastness being actually Evan's word for coming in very fast. Not an actual word. Alright, so we're coming in for a landing at good old Humboldt Mines. You guys know how much I absolutely fucking hate this place because there's a very good chance nothing fucking works here. And I have to be very careful just to make sure that I can get out of the ship. And there's another ship here that seems to be inverted, which seems to be a theme at the moment. Okay, so we are going to grab or put down. No, no, we're putting down. We've already picked up. Put that one there. Great. So, so far with Humboldt, I picked up two items. And we're coming in at Loveridge now, folks. Look at that landing. Camera view a little bit different this time. I would say for aesthetics, but just because I want to do something different. Ships off. And we've picked up another package, which we're putting on the other side. And then we pick up and go again. 
And now we're back at Humboldt Mines, folks. Yeah, nothing has been um, exciting so far, but it seems to be here. That, is that going to be enough room for me to get down? Anyway, we're putting in the first package. Is it going to give me a tick? All right. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, shit. I don't like that. Um... Is this going to work? Oh, I love low gravity moons. And have a look at that. He's strapping himself in. Seat's going back. Okay, well, let's do takeoff from this position as well. Try not to crash into anything. Can I put landing gear up? There we go. It's a nice view. I really like these mountain things. I hate the location for the actual the site but i like the area okay we'll just keep going so we're gonna head back to well weller specifically mark mark up that's a good place that's a new name for you mining area 48 on weller there's no mark up but we're gonna put this one in so that one's going in is it locked in yay three out of five packages delivered now, I'm wondering, is, first of all, looting still working? Let's check it out, folks. Um, nope. Okay, so for this particular video, looting doesn't want to work anymore after I did something with the red box. So that's all right. Kicking it's not going to help, F. Crouching down on the floor is also not going to help. I've got to get used to these fucking keys. Okay, but what's interesting, because I did see this when I was loading up the ship, Apparently, a diamond, okay, we've, we've got diamond. Apparently, this thing holds cargo. Apparently. I don't know where. See, it can hold up to, well, I don't want to count, but all of that. <laughs> what the fuck's tungsten? Or is that just one of the other um, containers I have on board? Anyway, let's see. 20 SCU at 80.13k okay that's buying price let's see what we what we're going to do with this i'm going to try to get a profit out of this hopefully yep yep let's buy it okay great so now for the life of me folks bear with me on this i have no idea where this is stored and also too because this elevator is the only way to get up and down out of the ship or in and out in future, when they do this whole, like, move your cargo around yourself type of bullshit, how the hell do they take their cargo in and out? I don't freaking know. Does this take me to a specific, like, cargo bay area? Lower deck, top deck. Okay, that's the lower deck. Okay. But that doesn't help me because it's the crew quarters, as we saw before. Escape pods. I'm not seeing anything different. And the bathroom area. And the crapper, which I'm not going to touch just in case I fall through the ship. So, and if you're wondering why I said that, there's a previous video. I'll probably link it up here. You have a good laugh. So, obviously, the bottom part, there's nowhere to store anything here. So, oh, well, hang on. No, I saw something, but I didn't see something. Okay. So, then where the fuck is the cargo hold? Is that even the door? Doesn't look like it. Oh, it looks like it, but it doesn't look like it. Okay. I didn't mean for this video to turn out to be a tour of the ship. I'm literally trying to figure out where the hell is a 20 SCU of cargo. It's not on a billiard table, that's for sure. Is this it? One, two, two, four. Okay. Um... If it is, they've changed the container, the, maybe? Let's have a look on the other side. Okay, it's balanced at least. So is this my cargo area, is it? Where's my fucking multi-tool? Damn it. They've changed the color of the containers and I don't know if this is an actual container or if it's actually part of the ship. I think it's a container. I'm hoping anyway. Um, but what's annoying me is I can't get my multi-tool anymore. What the hell's going on? Uh, f 
Fuck it. I don't know. No, those things also look like little containers as well. One SCU. Okay, cool. One, two, and that looks like two, four, six, eight. Sixteen. Okay, that's the fridge. All right, so, like I said, if that is the um, the the cargo area of the ship, which is fine, you got a part on one side, part on the other side, it's balanced. Okay, fair enough, makes sense if I was on water floating or an aircraft flying. All right, it's balanced. Um, so the question is now, how the hell do you get it on and off? Okay, more luxury rooms, nice. What, do they have reflection? No, okay. That hasn't come in yet. All right. We still got to do the um, package delivery run. I keep on forgetting that. I, I'm just so curious to see how this one is going to work with this ship in the future. And if they don't wipe the ship when this thing happens, I am definitely going to take this for a good laugh because I really want to see what the hell happens with that. Anyway, I digress. You guys want to see what the hell is going to happen. I want to see what the hell is going to happen. Am I going to make my 15K run out of this? Let's keep going. Ev, let's go. Press the button properly there, Ev. Okay, lift up. And yep, landing gear up, good. And we take off. And we're coming in for a landing, our last, well, not really, well, last landing for the mission, but not for the day. So we're at um, Arcorp Mining Area 56, still on Walla, and we have to deliver our last packages. So this one goes in, and then the next one, which is taking a bit of time to go in. Why is it taking a bit of time? Why is it bouncing back in my hands? Oh, please don't, don't fuck up now. Come on. Okay, what do we got here? So five out of five, contract delivery route complete. And it doesn't tell me at all how much I actually made. So this is the part I must admit I don't like. So it does say it's 15K reward. Okay, great. But delivery, does it still, if I click on that, and now it just says completed. See, that's the annoying part. It would be nice to actually see, even though it's completed, what you got for it. That's just a me thing. Um, reputation, reputation rep. Here we go. We want Kovalex. Okay, so we're still a bit of a way to go. So anyway, folks, we're going to take off and we're going to head back to Area 18. Like that. That was a quick flight, wasn't it? Now, more importantly, let's see what the hell's gonna happen here. So let's get my ship. Where is my ship? Why can't I see it? Ah, I have to scroll down. Uh -huh. <laughs> Whew. I've never had so many ships before, so I never ever came across this problem. Okay, so, okay, good to know. Diamond, what are we doing? Where are we selling it at? 86.04, that means that's going to be a profit of 5.91k. Mm-hmm. That will take a lot of time if it was just doing the um, diamond runs. Okay, folks, thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked this video. I know it was a bit faster than normal, but eh, we're mucking around. Let's see, where's the cash reserves? 127k AUEC. We got a long way to go before we start doing cargo runs again, that's for sure. Okay, again, thanks for watching. 